They went out slow and came home fast, and when it was over, and Tamirat Tola of Ethiopia was sprinting through the plaza and less invalids, the Olympic marathon once more proved why it can be that most captivating of races. On a bright and clear morning in Paris, eighty of the world's best distance runners blazed west out to Versailles and back to the center of the French capital, just ahead of a scorching afternoon, with Tola leading the way for most of it and finishing in an Olympic record time of two hours, six minutes, twenty-one seconds. Tola continued to be one of the sport's great late bloomers. A 32-year-old runner has become especially good at excelling in warmer conditions. He got his first big win at the World Athletics Championships in Eugene, Oregon in 2022, another summer race in uncomfortable conditions, then backed it up in New York last November, in unseasonably warm conditions. On Saturday morning, he captured another of the sport's ultimate prizes, and he did it running with the kind of aggressive style befitting a runner on a serious hot streak. After letting the little-known Iob Faniel of Italy lead for most of the first half of the race, Tola made his first move just before the halfway mark. He stayed at the front or close to it the rest of the way putting the hammer down after twenty miles, surging up a hill through the forest west of the city limits to create a gap that began at more than ten seconds between him and the chasers and stretching it out to twenty-one seconds by the time it was over. Belgium's Bashir Abi took the silver medal and Kenya's Benson Caputo took the bronze. Eliud Kipchog, a two-time gold medalist, and the only man to run the distance in less than two hours suffered from cramping early in the race and fell to the back of the pack before failing to finish.